<coughs> Hello everyone, this is Miss Flippin <coughs> here to give you your guidance for the week to see what it is that we need to put our energy in, put our focus in, so we can feel safe, secure, loving, warm, welcome. <coughs> okay. Let's see, I have this deck. It's been gifted to me. And it's your path through the enchanted forest. So, and I'd like to know, the shuffling has been real crazy here for a couple of weeks. And I think it's like kind of in the universe, kind of. <clears throat> I'm not quite certain, but that's what it seems to be. It doesn't matter where I'm at or which deck of cards I'm shuffling. They like to go all over the place. <coughs> okay. <coughs> Let's see what the deck has to share with us. <coughs> the Keeper of the Boon. Keep your, your wisdom, your self-grounded, your self-solid. Uh, keep your dreams going. Keep your whole, whole self as a being. And the keeper of the challenge is, uh, it's like we have um, the higher, higher sources that are, and letting us know that that's what we definitely need to do. See, we take our time and ground ourselves. Okay, I know I need to ground myself. I was grounding myself this morning. And I've gone through lots of different feelings, different emotions going on. Let's see what else. Let's see. It says, Seeker of the Boons. <clears throat> Just keep seeking the things that you like to do. And it might not be seeking the same way that everybody else seeks. It is the same way as seeking. Let the nature out there tell it. Tell us what it is we're supposed to do. It, you know, we know what we're supposed to do, but let us sh show us uh, how it loves us back and gives us what it is that we need back. <clears throat> now let's see what else. What else would you like everybody to know? What it is we should. Be doing, just grounding ourselves, allowing that, <clears throat> or the earth support us, the ground to support us, look at what we got, yeah, we got one, two, three people sitting on the ground, and what's it going to give us, it's going to give us strength, what's it going to give us strength through, it's going to give us strength through the heartaches, it's going to give us strength through the tears, it's going to give us the strength to make movement in the direction that we need to go. And sometimes in the direction we need to know, go, it means that we have to leave some loved ones behind because maybe they don't quite understand. We don't understand either. We don't want to leave our loved ones behind. So it's saying stay grounded. It's going to give you strength. <clears throat> and it's coming from the higher source, you know. So it's saying we need everyone to be grounded, to be able to work and operate from their best self. That, that is a message from the highest council, from the universe, from the animals. They're, they're saying, hey, this is what we need to bring in a new vision. And the new vision is from a beautiful place. It doesn't matter which way we look, we see beauty. I know that we're all going through uh, this coronavirus thing that's out there. And it's still from the higher so sources telling us to ground ourselves and to trust the universe knows what it's doing. And it's bringing us strength from all our heartaches and from all our tears, um, even from maybe loved ones that we have to uh, not be around or maybe they are no longer with us. And this is an order from the highest Council. I mean, look at all those animals are saying, hey, hey, we need this to happen. And why do we need it to happen? Because we need the beauty to shine. 
With the beauty to shine through the dull moment in the day, through the week, through the month, to bring us on top of the world so we can look at this universe being this is we're like heaven. We are like heaven here on this planet, on this earth right now, and, and enjoy this moment right now. So we can be operating from a higher self. Okay, being on top of the world. Knowing that we know our answers and know that they you know, we just have to trust each direction we're going and you know and you know, we can look back and see where where we've come and where we've been but to trust that it's all in divineness and all in a perfect order but i was wondering because see how he's looking back this one this is new beginnings looking back to see where the new beginnings are taking us the new beginnings are taking us to joy, happy surroundings, laughter, dancing, play. Um, far more challenges. From our visions. From walking away from hiding from ourselves. We brought this better family, friends, energy forward from a new place in this world. So, this is the bottom of the deck, and it says, um, just take it at whatever it is that you do, bring easy, easy into it, bring that lightness into it, bring the stars in, bring this the sparkle in. Let this new sparkly, loving energy flow through our lives. Let that be our new way from grounding ourselves and trusting in the planet, trusting in the earth, trusting in the animals, trusting in source, that it's looking for the beautiful swan within then we, when we make it to the top, we remember to look back to say we started with the childlike mind to get over all these, these uh, um, past ways, no longer having to hide from self and being true and coming out and being with the family and with joy and happiness and laughter and play and excitement. But honoring who you are with ease with joy with the star like with the universe's energy let the universe help provide for us in another way not you know we always looking for everybody else and going and going and going and doing and doing and doing and being you know in different uh, energies of our life but it's saying let those old you know energies fast paced energies um, pass away and let us take time to ground ourselves and bring the beautiful way in and the, a better flow forward, a better way to operate in our days. Okay, that is your reading for right now. And uh, take this information and let it lead you and guide you. Remember to, to ground yourself. Remember to let it bring strength. Remember to let your beauty shine. Remember this is about bringing harmony and peace within the world within ourselves within all okay until next time this is miss flip it uh, giving you a read just again to help lead you and support you and guide you to a better way and if you would like my free digital download you can go to bit.ly slash flip in life okay well thank you and have a beautiful day till next time